Hello, greetings. I am Lakesh. Uh, Max, how Hello, are you? What? It's been a very long time since I have seen you. Yeah, I miss you. I miss uh, you actually, as well. I think, I think um, I had a trip at which I think I invited you, so I hope you were there because it was a very nice trip. Ah, I go along on many trips. People invite me many places. Sometimes I cannot uh, go because I have things I have to do, but I at least spend some time on their journeys with them. And so, yes, I did spend some time with you. Uh, actually, it was a, 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 a natural trip, but yeah. I understand. Uh -huh. I go on many kinds of trips. <laughs> All right. Um, anything new you wanted to share? Only that our people are being, might paying very much attention to your people during this time as a, of ascension. And we are giving great... A comment and great advice to those that are around you so that you may rise up in even better and more smooth ways than originally thought could be. Uh huh. And yeah, um, so how many people are working with us right now from your civilization? Oh, about there is about eight of us that are channelers to your world, which uh -huh. uh, are. Our world considers that ambassadorships in some ways. There are some that are uh, ambassadors to the United States and the English speaking areas. And then there are some that are uh, working with other languages and Asia and, and things of this nature. I think I remember now you gave us a name Koreatorians, I think for your race, is it right? What? I think for your race, you gave us a name, which was Koreatorians. Yes. Uh-huh. Um, so my question was, um, who should we speak to invite for the record for, the, for the, our YouTube channel? What of the aliens or any other spiritual beings would you recommend? For what channeling? For uh, YouTube. Uh, YouTube channel. It is a, a public uh, public um, broadcasting system. Oh, who would I think that would be good to be uh, shown there? Inter yeah, interviewed through Jim. Yes. Oh, there are many. There are many out here beyond beyond your world that would be good as well. But there are many uh -huh. from your spiritual realm, uh, uh -huh. ascended masters, and those with great information. Um, some that you might not expect that would be giving great information, but would, like Hitler. Adolf Hitler would be an interesting, because he has changed so much. He was psychologically unstable when he was on the planet, and he was actually not a negative person. He tried to be as positive as possible. Conquest was his idea of bringing everyone into a positive realm. But no one saw that as he saw it. And, and actually he did not know that there were those um, generals and commanders working uh, on their own to bring negativity. Of course there was the ethnic cleansing which was not right, but he saw it in the most positive light you can imagine. So he would be an interesting character. I studied his biography very carefully. I read a few books and um, very advanced books. And uh, uh, yeah, he was clearly driven by, uh, by some supernatural forces. But, and yes. he made some, some agreements with them. But um, I think from the very beginning, there was uh, so much association with criminals and darkness. It was all uh, impregnated yes. with, with the flaw. It was very yes. flawed from the very start. Um, uh, he, he, he came to power and stayed in power only through, through very criminal actions. So I don't seem uh, to respect much of his approaches. Well, he was self-delusional, yes, yes, but... He is no longer part of, of, of the human race. Uh -huh. He is different. He is very different. He sees things differently, and 
of course, when he comes back, he would have the understanding of who he was at this, in this uh, realm. But yes, he was uh, deceived. Let's put it that way. He was very much deceived by many things. I remember there was a, a funny uh, episode. I mean, one of the, I mean, he went through many crises, but one of the worst ones was when he hoped that uh, three leaders of, I think it was Bavaria, three leaders of, military leaders of Bavaria would uh, go along with him and take over the, the area, but they refused. And that was, uh, he arrested basically them. And it was, I think the beer putsch called, it was a beer putsch or something like that. Yes. And uh, he arrested them and they refused to, to go along with him, but he came out to the public and said that they agreed. And the public uh, accepted that they, they believed him. And then he came back to these three guys and said the public has already approved it. So, so I think they went along with him for a little while, but that was an outright lie. And, um, and it was his signature style just to pretend that things are going well when they are actually not. Well, you must have... You must understand, though, he had a um, problem. <laughs> it was not quite right. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, I mean, um, yeah, that's one of, you know, that ability to, to uh, they call it reality shift or um, how they say, reality transforming field. Was was uh, his talent, and also it was a, a talent of Steve Jobs, reality transforming field. He yes. would believe into something and make others believe in the same thing. Yes, I think he's a very interesting character because he even fooled himself many times. Of course, of course. But uh, he built his career on on uh, on uh, racial um, cleaning, and uh, I think it was. Um, it, it is too much for us. Ethnic cleansing was not a good idea, no. But the, many, many of his original thoughts about a good and perfect world were good. But yes, I found him very interesting, especially uh, the, the after part of who he was. When he ascended, he became very different. Uh-huh. So, who else would you recommend? Oh, I like... The, he was one of my favorites because he was so different and unusual. But I do like uh, many of the others. You were saying Plato. Plato was uh -huh. interesting. Uh-huh. Uh, Homer, the writer Homer was interesting. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Um. Let's see, there's many of the, the Egyptians were very interesting. Of course, you've already spoken to many of them. Not actually, not me. Maybe other people spoke. I didn't speak to many Egyptians yet. Jim has channeled many Egyptians. But not to me. Oh, not to you, no. Uh-huh. But there are so many. Benjamin Franklin. Uh-huh. I will have to study him. I, I, I usually do my homework before I invite a human uh, historical figure. Very well. Uh -huh. Who else from the, the outside the... world, from the galactic world? Oh, yes. The outside world, the, uh, Ken Jean is very interesting. Uh -huh. um, he is the king of era. Uh -huh. <coughs> there are others. Uh, Lin Chin Chian Chata is very uh -huh. interesting uh -huh. from Maya. Also, many of the people from the John Dai Council are very interesting. Um, oh, I'm not familiar. What's what John Dai Council? John Dai Council is, you've heard of the Jedi. That is, uh -huh. that is actually from, that's a word derived from John Dai Council. And there okay. are beings around and there are people on your planet, actually, that consider them Jedi, themselves Jedi people. Mm -hmm. <coughs> there is another call, council called the Jedi Council. It is okay. a far away in a different uh, galaxy. 
but there are those that subscribe that their energies are also very interesting and very uh, powerful these days. There's okay. 26, 25 members and uh, one of the royal family. So it's 25 Jondi council members with the energies of the Jondi and one royal member. Okay. Are they related to Earth? Are they working with, on Earth? Yes. The Mayan people are in charge of the ascension in some ways, according to ancient prophecies. Okay. All right. Um, can you ask if, if any of the, of the Jodai um, related people could uh, speak, a speaker for them could, could meet us right now? Of course, of course. When would you want to do that? Right now? Right now? Oh, you would like to speak to a member of the Jondai Council now? Uh, a speaker, it doesn't have to be a member. Whoever is uh, better represented the, his history of that. Well, the royal family member is Lin Chin Chen Chata. Okay. And she will speak for them if you wish. All right, wonderful. One moment, please. Have a wonderful day, Max. It was good to see you again. Thank you. Nice to see you. Nice to connect. And let's meet more often. Ah, I would love that. And I will tell you the names of my colleagues if you want to call on them as well. All right. Give me the names. You have Kalish. I am Lakash. There is Kalish. Jean Jean. Arusha. Let's see who else is there. Well, those are the ones that are the English speaking ones. Uh huh. Okay. Very good. I will be back with, I will bring uh, Lin Chin Chatter to you. Lin Chin Chan Chatter. Lin Chin Chan Chatter. Yes. Thank you.